Hey everyone, so I wanted to do a video about our plans, whether or not we were going to do extended rear facing or forward facing with Elena since she's almost one and in California the law is when they're one years old that you can forward face them. Kind of went back and forth on this because she grew out of her infancy, as many of you know, um, probably like two weeks ago when she's 10 months old. I didn't want to get a forward facing car seat yet just because I wasn't sure whether or not I wanted to forward face her when she did turn one and she had outgrown the height limits for her infant car seat so she really didn't have a car seat. The other dilemma with that is that I didn't want to get the convertible car seat because I was like okay if I'm going to forward face her and she's 10 months old and she's borderline the <clears throat> limit for her infant car seat could I just wait until she was two more months and forward face her. What I decided to end up doing was to get a convertible car seat which is an Eddie Bauer car seat and I'll insert a picture of it. And I decided to get the convertible Eddie Bauer car seat because I wanted to be able to, to do extended rear facing with her if that's what we chose to do. So basically I don't really have an age. Most people say two is when they decide to forward face or even longer. And I know all of the dangers and the cautions that come with it. I've done tons of research. So I totally know all the car seat safety stuff. And so I don't honestly know when I want to turn her around. I want to say around one and a half that I'm going to forward face her. I don't know. I mean, um, I don't want to say exactly when because I don't even know myself and I don't want to promise something that I don't know uh, my own plans for. Basically, as of right now, at 10 and a half months, she'll be 11 months in a week. We are still rear facing her because that's the law. And when she turns one years old, the Eddie Bauer convertible car seat that we have right now will allow her to rear face until she's 45 pounds. Excuse me guys, I had to switch rooms because Helena was trying to go up the stairs. I'm thinking around one and a half, maybe two years old, we're going to forward face her. She's actually a pretty good baby rear faced and I know it's 10 times safer and she just does really, really good with it. I know some kids cry and really don't like it, but she's a pretty good extended rear facer, which is why I feel comfortable leaving her like that. I know a lot of people want to turn their kids around just because that's the way that they're better in the car, but with her, she's really, really good. So um, as for now, we're going to keep extended rear facing. I do have two Graco car seats, which I'll insert a picture. One's gonna go in my husband's car and the other's gonna go in my car. So when we decide to forward face her, she has that car seat. And then the Eddie Bauer convertible car seat that we have right now, we're going to give it to my in-laws, which is super nice by the way. If anybody needs a convertible car seat, I highly suggest the Eddie Bauer one. The comfortability factor of that car seat and everything. I just love that car seat, it's really awesome. I haven't tried the Graco one, so I can't really do a review on that. I took So right now, her infant car seat, which went up to 30 inches, which she is 29 or 30 inches right now, is currently packed away. We're not gonna use it in, um, until next baby. And then right now we have just the Eddie Bauer convertible car seat in my car, which is what we're using for her. And she, she is rear facing currently. And that's what she's going to be doing until we decide to forward face her. And like I said, I really don't have a time of when that's going to be. I know what all the literature says. So everyone has to do what works for their own family and we're going to do what works for ours. So. As soon as we feel that Elena um, is ready to forward face or she needs to forward face, that's what we're going to do. And then when she does forward face, each of us have our own car seat for her. And it's a three-in-one, the Graco that we have. So it goes into a booster and she'll be able to use that until she's eight and doesn't need to have any sort of car seat. We'll see you guys later. Bye. Uh. What are you doing, miss? Uh. Uh.